What's up, Jacksonville? It's the media mogul, Dan Hicken, catching you up on all things Jacksonville sports as we head into the weekend. As always, let's start with our Jacksonville Jaguars. Now a weekend, we've got our draft class. We got Trevor. That's the most important thing, right? Everything else is gravy. You can break down the draft any way you want. The bottom line is this. The Jaguars got Trevor Lawrence. Trevor Lawrence is excited about being in Jacksonville. Trevor Lawrence has signed all kinds of endorsement deals. Trevor Lawrence sold more jerseys than anybody else in the history of the league on draft night. That's what playing in the NFL means, and it's okay to be in little old Jacksonville. Welcome to town, Trevor. We can't wait to see what you're able to do. Travis Etienne also, by the way, joining him. Those two combined for, oh gosh, 150 plus touchdowns while they were at Clemson. All right, now let's talk a little bit of hardball, right? College style. we got the Gators, and we've got FSU to bring you up to date on. Uh, listen, Florida's playing better, man. Huge series against Vanderbilt. Took two out of three. They were down nine to one on Friday night. And they came back and made that a game. And then they won Saturday and they beat Leiter. And then they won Sunday and they took two of three from number two Vandy. Now they've got three series left. It starts this weekend with Kentucky in the Commonwealth. Kentucky's good, not great. Florida needs to win the series. Florida needs to win the series against Georgia. They wrap at Arkansas, the number one team in the country. That'll be a great challenge. But if they can win those series, Maybe just maybe work their way up into a top eight. We'll see if that's able to happen. The Knowles did take two out of three from Troy. FSU will get into a, we won in the, in the field of 64. They won't be hosting. Uh, they're 23 and 16 overall, lost one game to Troy. They've got tough series with Notre Dame coming up this weekend. So they have their hands full, filled as well. All right, high school fo- uh, baseball. Oh, high school football is going on right now, spring football. Uh, but high school baseball, and softball in full swing postseason wise. And man, you want to talk about high school baseball. We've told you how many good teams there are. The creme de la creme, maybe St. John's Country Day. They've won nine straight by a combined score, 91 to 18. They're rolling everybody um, and really hitting the ball. So, but keep an eye out. Lots of good teams in the area. Go, go check it out. Softball as well. It should be a lot of fun. We'll start to narrow it down next week and see who has a legitimate shot at winning a state championship. That's all we got today, ladies and gentlemen. Check out your local baseball, softball matchups throughout the weekend. Sit back, relax, and enjoy the weekend here in Jacksonville, FLA. And we'll see you next time on Jacksonville's Weekend in Sports.